difficulty is what does the market need this week in the five years and the ten years because they're different things you know right now people need programmers data scientists you know because the machines are not are, are too stupid to do it yeah. so a telecom engineer today finds work in ten years no right because in ten years engineering a telecom network will be automated yeah. because the machines will learn it I mean this is just a question of time so what do you need in 10 years? You need somebody who designs the machines that will build the telecom network or who is an AI human interface designer. You need the next level, right? So we have to educate, you know, every couple of years we have to think about what is the next wave of what we need. Right? And this idea that you would have technical skills and then you, you certainly have a job, that's just ridiculous. Yeah? Um, I think we need to have a huge investment in science and Invention, but we also need investment in uh, the human humanities. You know, art, culture, philosophy, uh, because in the end, this is the only thing that machines can't do. Machines will even do the science for us. A lot of the learning a teacher will not uh, stop when you get out of school, because teaching and learning will be a lifelong activity. So we have to also have programs for 30-year-old people who are saying, you know, uh, my my job as a programmer is ending and I, I want to do interface design or I want to do something and they have to be able to go somewhere. So I think it would be ideal to have six month courses for anybody who says, okay, I'm going to learn how to do data science. I'm going to learn how to, how to, do, uh, how to understand AI. I'm going to write a book or whatever it is. You know, six months and the government should pay for six months every couple of years to get on to the next thing, you know? In Finland, this is already happening, you know, because they spend lots of money on education. But what we are doing is we're saying, okay, if you just study the right thing, you'll have a good job, you know. And, and that's completely false, because those jobs don't exist anymore. We have to make our job. Right? I mean, we're, we're freelancers. We work, we make our job. Every week we make a new piece of our job, and we keep mutating. Yeah? Uh, and that's a skill you have to learn.